10th Mountain Division, Rainier Chapter, at Snoqualmie Pass Ski Inn, March 24th, 1989. You will see the performance of the Precision Skiers in white. Schmuzzle. It's snowing up here today. Okay, here is the 10th Mountain Precision Ski Team getting ready to go into action. The next scene you will see will be coming down the Snoqualmie Hill. Now we're going to and now we're zooming in and give you a close up of each of the contestants. There's the gang. There's the whole gang. Now they're going to march out. Let's go ski. Okay. Keep that thing running there. There they're marching by. We're going to sing that to me. This is Hank Seidel Huber. One of the old ski troopers. The sex maniac. We're so proud of him. Hey, is this on sound? Yes, it I is. I love you, Nussbaum. Yeah, I, I know. Love you. Well, you love me. Uh oh. Hey, how about that blanket? White boots and white gloves. Attention, skiers. The 10th Mountain Division Pando Commando demonstration team will be performing on Big Bill under the direction of Carl Stingle at 2 p.m. This is the Mount Belvedere Ski made by the K2 Ski Company in honor of the 10th Mountain Division. The sun's coming out. Yep, just rush. 
This is Carl Stingle, head of the Precision Pando Ski Team. Would you say a few words, Carl, and explain what you're doing? Well, we'll just ski down the hill and we'll just follow the leader. And when we come in down here at the bottom, we'll just sort of line up in a column of twos. And now tell them why you're wearing white suits. So people can't see us. Is that good or bad? <laughs> you look awful. <laughs> okay, thank you. Carl Stingle of the 10th Mountain Division, Rainier Chapter. <laughs> Colonel farmed us out to whatever which company wanted needed us on the assaults. Yeah. Here the guys are going up the lift now. I can't see who they are. <laughs> the Pando Commandos are forming on the top of the summit, ready to make their attack to the valley floor. Here come the Pando Commandos, swinging jauntily down the hill, to and throw. All in step, Carl Stingle in the lead, he's the drill sergeant. Looks like a bunch of ants. <laughs> Has anybody fallen down yet? Those guys in the black, just somebody following them down? I guess so. Now oh, they're forming up again. Okay, they've been called to a halt. They're forming up. Here come the Pando Commandos again. Now we're getting a better look at them. Precision skiing. Precision skiing. <laughs> skiing by the numbers. Coming closer down the hill. There they're coming to us now. Look at that picture of Grace. Just a, a rhythm on the slopes. Look at these guys, they're tremendous. We're so proud of them. Get in step. Hi guys. Ah, oh, you're doing wonderful. We're so proud of you. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Here they come by. Nobody fell down. Beautiful precision skiers. These people in the rear are better than they are. Sergeant Carl Stingle is going to give them the orders. Hut to, hut to. Here we come around. And... There are the troops in formation, just like at Camp Hale. Look at them, aren't they a motley looking crew? How the hell did we win the Second World War?
the Pando Commandos. Hut, one, two, one, two. Suck it in, suck those bellies in. <laughs> We're so proud of you. We love you, Nuss We love you. <laughs> I want to go back and get a picture of you. Uh -huh. Like you mean to get a picture of you in this thing? Sure, can you? Show me how to do it. Uh, I want you folks to meet Irv Pratt, the head of the ancient skiers, a grand fellow. He's an associate member of the Rainer chapter, the Pando Commandos. Would you like to say a few words, Oriving? Let me get my wallet out. I'll pay you. Okay, tell them about the museum and the come, ancient skiers and everything. Come and visit us in the museum. We're open from 11 to 3 every Saturday and Sunday. Bring money. <laughs> now, if the, uh, if the person doesn't move in the museum, he's dead. So yes. be sure to, uh, to touch people to see if they're part of the exhibit. Especially the girls. <laughs> they're in front of the Stoquolamy Lodge and uh, so one of our best associate members is Mr. Moffat, Webb Moffat. He's up on the balcony observing the Pando Commandos. Uh, Webb, say a few words, yell it out loud. What do you have to say? Great show. Great show. He's waving to us saying great show. We hope so too. We love you, Webb Moffat. We love you. Your name Beanie Morris? She's a goddamn jackass. That's on your table. That's true. I'm good. They joined up in the mountain group to put it to the test. And everywhere they went, they gave their war whoop. Oh, give me skis and some full holes and twister. And let me ski way up on Elder Mister. You can take their snowshoes and stuff your sister and sister. And everywhere they went, they gave their war whoop. <laughs> The mountain trooper, as seen on the cover of the Saturday, Saturday Evening Post in the 1940s, a very famous picture. On at Camp Hale, he's all dressed in white like the Rainier chapter just demonstrated. <laughs> 